Good evening, gentlemen. We're so happy to be back with you tonight. Um, we've got a unique brew with us this evening. It's a goose. <laughs> Say that again? Goose. <laughs> oh, man. It's a Girardin uh, <clears throat> Belgian beer made uh, by combining lambics, and they're fermented again, and Jason's going to open it for us. So this is a beer I've had once before, and just remember that it was strange. But these guys have never had it, so uh, mm. we are in for a bit of a bizarre treat, I think. I was just gonna pop some of like champagne, or that's right. I guess we'll see. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, somewhat. Okay. All right. I do love Belgian beers. Yep, and we were actually pouring these into champagne flutes, like um, you would a lambic. Like you would a yeah. lambic. <clears throat> yeah. so this is essentially derived from a lambic. What kind of lambic? It says on there. Um, Oud Lambic? I'm not sure. This is 100% something. I think lambic. Lambics are traditionally made not by... Oh, uh, wow. I can smell that from here. Wow. It smells like horse blanket. Um, just, just to let you know, <laughs> this, beer is, <laughs> this beer is actually filling the room. I can smell this beer from, from here. It's, it's very barnyard. <laughs> okay. <laughs> It, <laughs> it smells like horseshit. <laughs> I'm sorry. It does. Did you smell it yet? No. It does remind me of oh my God. a horse <laughs> manure. Type of horse manure is much better. But a very sweet horse manure. Oh, man. Jason, you gotta play something together. This is on YouTube. Right. Now, now I've never tasted a horse blanket before. But if I were, okay, we ready? We're, we're done talking about the nose. Are you tasted it? Yes. No, I haven't tasted it yet. What do I? What do I say about it? I'm definitely. Okay, I get some strong hay. It tastes like. It smells like horse manure. It smells like sweaty uh, livestock. <laughs> okay, it's not that bad. It's it doesn't. Barnyard. It doesn't smell like all those things. It smells. It smells like a farm, but it it's, like farm. it's also got some fruit there. Definitely fruit, and uh, probably okay. a strong kind of blue cheese. I kind of get. That's like if I, I smelled this blind, if the fruit wasn't there, there's no way I would want to drink this. The fruit makes me intrigued, but I still probably wouldn't. All right, want to drink this, but we're gonna do this, right? Cheers right, here up. We go. Bottoms up. All right, that is like sour. Grape juice, basically, okay. to me. Oh, definitely getting like, the hay now. <laughs> yep, it's sour apple. For sour, sure. yeah, definitely um, apple. Yeah, it's a very strong acidity. Um, yeah, extremely right. acidic. Uh, medium to strong carbonation. A lot of people that make this beer I believe we read um, this type of beer will add sugar to help the. Yeah, to make it more drinkable. To make it more drinkable. Mm -hmm. It's hard. It's hard to get away from me, from picturing, just a stall with horses, being in it, from a uh, farmer shoveling. All right. Horses well then, cow manure. stop talking about it because I have a beer <laughs> tasting right now. I'm um, saying. Just... No, I I definitely I definitely think there is actually quite a bit of complexity to that. It's extremely I, complex. Oh, I actually extremely. I actually somewhat enjoy that. Um, in a weird way. I think the aftertaste um, is really pleasant. Every time I, I take a swig, it shocks me. Definitely way better on the palate than it is in the nose, in my opinion. It's um, weird to know that this is a derivative of Lambic. Yeah. It's Lambics I've had, this is just so far of a deviation. Yeah, from. that's right. Every Lambic yeah. I've had has been super fruity like candy. Yeah. But it Which, is. but the thing this is... is rancid candy. The fermented candy, <laughs> perhaps. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I would say fermented candy would very well describe this beer. With a bit of... Hay mixed in. Because there's some uh, strong sweetness there. Yeah, yeah there really is. Um, you just really have to kind of dig deep to find it. You have to I'm just trying, get... I'm trying to hold my nose as I drink it here. Actually, I kind of now enjoy the smell of it after I've tasted it. Um, I was definitely That's getting... That's true. I was definitely getting the horse. Actually, the nose is much more pleasant after you taste it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right away. It's really odd how It's still a bizarre. You... It's... Like, of all the heavy beers, high alcohol beers, like stouts, this one punches yeah. you in the mouth. This beer is unique. Yeah. Um, um, very much. There's no hop. Nothing. There's no hops at all. There's no. There's barely a hint of malt. Of it the, is like, very grains. zippy, though. Very carbonated. It's, it's very carbonated. Yeah, there's a sharpness there. Yeah. 
Um, it's not bitterness, but it's like it's replaced by the sour. Sour, tang, mm. tanginess. Very, very tangy. Very tangy. It's basically like a very like an overly cider. fermented cider. That's mm-hmm. what it tastes like, with grassy notes. I think for a grade, I I will not even know where to begin. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard to even call this a beer. How can we even uh, this? Yeah, but. I think, you know, for the benefit of the doubt, which I'm more... Every time. I, I, this is definitely worth a try. And I don't, I agree. for that reason, I don't want to give it a bad grade. I don't think the quality Maybe we of shouldn't this even is, grade it. Maybe Because what can we compare this against? I think our grade should be... You should try this. You've got to get this. Though. Yeah. This, this is, is worth at least one try. This is, Let us know what you think. Because yeah. who knows whether you will love it or hate it or just your world will be blown. I'm liking this more and more. Yeah, I can see that. I can see how it would be more enjoyable, but still, it punches me in the teeth every time I taste it. I feel it. like I might get stomach after Germany. <laughs> this this like style it. of beer is when I learned that Chimay is not what defines Belgium. Um, yeah. Belgium is capable of some crazy stuff. Yes. That's right. So this right. is definitely worth a try. Uh, we're going to finish this mm-hmm. and uh, keep getting punched in the mouth. Mm, so right. thanks for watching. Yeah, cheers. Cheers. cheers.